Hello friends. I am glad to welcome you on my channel. I always have a lot of new reviews for you. Subscribe and like. In recent years, smartphone manufacturers have been actively experimenting with the location of front cameras in an effort to make their devices as frameless as possible. The cameras moved as close as possible to the upper face of the case, placed in cutouts, including compact, drop-shaped, and even in the holes in the display. In some cases, even slide-out camera modules or slider designs were used. To this diversity, ZTE decided to add another option and offered it in its new smartphone concept. To make the side frames around the display as thin as possible and spoil the screen with a cutout, ZTE engineers equipped the concept of the ZTE Axon V smartphone with a 3D camera module in the form of a protrusion on the side face of the case. This module includes two sensors. It is located on a hard protrusion on the right side. The design does not retract into the case when the front camera is not in use. Thanks to this original design, it was possible to bring the ratio of the display to the front panel area to 100% as close as possible. However, the exact value is not reported. Smartphone ZT Axon V is equipped with a 6.8-inch OLED panel with an aspect ratio of 21. 9, like the Sony Xperia 1, Xperia 10 and Xperia 10 Plus. Such a device is designed to provide more convenient consumption of cinematic content, including streaming video. On the back of the smartphone ZTE Axon V is available dual camera. It is located in the usual place, and not in the ledge of the body. As noted in ZTE, the space freed up inside the case is planned to be used to install an enlarged battery with a larger capacity. On the functionality of the front 3D camera is not reported. Probably, in addition to taking self-portraits, it can also be used to more securely recognize the user's face. Also, this design can be useful in the tasks of augmented reality. Despite the fact that so far ZT Axon V is only a concept, it is likely to see this device as a commercial product on the market this year. There will be a lot of interesting information for you on my channel, do not forget to subscribe and like. See you again on my channel.